So uh, quite a bit has happened in the last two weeks since I put one out. Uh, I graduated. So I officially have my blue cord. I'm now certified as a qualified infantry officer, which is nice because for the last, ever since I've been an LT, I've basically just been a nobody. But now at least I'm a nobody who somewhat knows what they're doing. Emphasis on the somewhat. So what happens is if you're active duty uh, and you just complete eye bullock, they immediately put you in a ranger platoon, which is the platoon in the company that kind of focuses entirely on getting you ready for ranger school physically, um, in terms of tasks, in terms of your fitness, um, all that other stuff that you could expect to do. And how it was kind of expected was I was originally probably going to go into July class. That means I would have had this month and then all of June because there's no June Ranger class to prepare for probably an early July Ranger class. What then happened is they changed the criteria of going and since I've been here longer than most people, I was shot straight up to the list of the OML. So that means I'm now going in like less than two weeks. And so right now we've been in entirely focusing on RTTs, which are your basic skills of putting together and taking apart 240s, taking apart and putting together two types of radios, and then setting up properly and placing a claymore. And all those are to time and to a certain exact standard and order that they want. And then we've also been doing classes where we just kind of go over all the basic in terms of you know how to set up a patrol, how to conduct this certain type of movement, how to conduct this certain type of attack to the exact standard that the Rangers are looking for, not kind of how we've already established with our unit internal SOPs after all the training we just did. Because now we have to relearn it essentially exactly how the Rangers want it, no compromise. Uh, that said, I have less than two weeks now to get ready. I think after taking the last RPA, which is the Fair Ranger physical fitness test that you have to take when you get there, I passed that fine, had no issues with it. And then with my training that I've been doing the last, last week and then these leading up next two weeks, I think I'll be even slightly better prepared for it. But that's just kind of a heads up that once a two week mark hits, because if I were to take a camera somehow into Ranger school, that would be one of the dumbest things I've ever done in my entire life. <sighs> my cat wanted to be part of the video. Didn't you talk her? This is Tucker, by the way. What are you doing? Anyway, that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna keep this really short. I'm gonna have one more video hopefully come out before, I, before I'm done with this section. Um, it'll be kind of like a comprehensive eye bullet thing, kind of lighthearted, almost harkening back to what I used to do. So that's kind of what the state of the channel is gonna be looking like. I'll give a really quick update on here right before I leave. And then uh, that's what it's gonna look like. Wish me luck. Thank you.